Hello everyone, uh, welcome back. So today we'll be talking about uh, access reviews. So basically Azure Active Directory access reviews enable organizations to efficiently manage uh, group memberships, access to enterprise applications and role assignments. So user access can be reviewed on a regular basis to make sure uh, only the right people have the access. So let's go ahead and uh, start. So let's go to Azure Active Directory and then just go to identity governance here you can see the access reviews click that and let us go and create a new access reviews click that and uh, here you can see we have two different options so teams plus groups and applications let's uh, click the teams uh, plus groups here you can see we have two different options all Microsoft 365 groups uh, with guest users and uh, select teams plus groups so the first option is uh, so if, if you would like to create a uh, recurring reviews on all your guest users uh, across all the Microsoft teams and uh, 365 groups in organization then you can select the first option and uh, coming to the second option uh, you can select this uh, if you would like to specify a finite set of teams and or groups to review so in this case i'll be giving the first one so let it be the guest user and uh, let's go ahead to the second one and one more thing like there is one uh, called applications so you can select applications here so for example uh, you should note that if you select more than one application let us say uh, you have selected around three or four applications then there will be four access reviews that will be created so this is the one thing that you need to keep in your mind and uh, let's go to the previous options and uh, you can also exclude the people if you want so in this case i'm not uh, selecting anyone let's go to the next and uh, here you can see we have uh, select reviewers and we have group owners select uh, users or groups uh, user reviews their own access and uh, managers of users so in this case I'm selecting the first one and uh, coming to the fallback users for example if the group owners doesn't respond so these are the people who will be responding for that so in this case I'm just keeping myself and uh, a test user let us say test one and uh, here you can see uh, uh, so you can specify the recurrence of the reviews so duration of the days uh, duration of the recurrence and start date so the start date is today and uh, here you can see uh, you can keep it weekly monthly or uh, so on so in this case let me keep it weekly and it will never end so basically this defines how long a review will uh, be open for the input from the reviewers so that is the thing and uh, let's go to the next so in this you can see uh, if the reviews doesn't uh, respond for example the group owner or the people that we have added recently in the previous one if that doesn't respond so these are the different options no change uh, remove access uh, approve access and take recommendations coming to the no change so it will leave the user's access unchanged coming to the remove access it will be the remo uh, it will remove the access and uh, coming to the approve it will approve the access and coming to the take recommendations it will uh, take the system's recommendations on denying or uh, approving the user's uh, continue access so for example if we remove the access so it will uh, it will remove the user's membership from the resources and uh, it will block the user from signing uh, for 30 days from that uh, per tenant and uh, you can see you can uh, get the uh, justification required so you need to give the justification uh, when you start the review and uh, you can get the email notification or the reminder so on so let's go to the next review and create you can add uh, the description if you want 
in this case I'm just leaving it alone so you can just go ahead and create let's check everything is okay yeah so we'll be getting email notifications yeah so basically uh, you'll uh, like it will send the email notifications to the reviewers uh, when an access uh, review starts and to the administrators when the review completes you can enable the justification so reviews to supply a reason for their approval and so on okay so let's go ahead and create so this is how you can create an access to reviews so hope you guys have understood the concept how to create an access review so this is the access review that we have created so if you have liked the video please click the like button below and uh, if you have not subscribed to my channel please do subscribe to my channel and thank you